How important is this fight for you in terms of uh, starting to build a bit of momentum? We know you're a champion over in deep. Um, yeah, man, like as far as the importance of this fight, man, I, I have to say this is definitely um, probably one of the more important fights of my career because, uh, you know, my age, um, just for many reasons, actually, um, I lost my last two in Ryzen, which is definitely not a good thing. Um, but, uh, man, I, it's, it's a huge fight. Um, you know, I need to get back on a winning track in Ryzen and, um, also not only just winning, but putting on a good show and, uh, man, I'm hoping they can work out an open weight title or heavyweight title. Um, you know, maybe a Grand Prix or something. That'd be something I'd love to do. Yeah. Do you think, uh, that that is the route they'll go down. I've heard Jake Hoon talk about wanting uh, an open weight title. Do you think that there are enough good names for a Grand Prix right now? Um, uh, as far as the heavyweight division in Ryzen, yeah, I know it's not that stacked, but <clears throat> I don't think Ryzen would have a hard time getting heavyweights into Ryzen, just because I see it a lot on social media. A lot of people want to fight in Ryzen, just because of the experience, the production. Um, fighting in Japan, the whole thing there. So, um, man, if they hyped it up and built up that, uh, I think once they say open weight Grand Prix is um, announced, like you'll get a lot of um, skilled heavyweights and yeah, like you said, light heavyweights that'll probably compete in there as well. So, um, yeah, I think I think it's definitely a, a possibility, you know, that they get that going. You talked about uh, this being a really important fight for you and maybe your age is a factor, but you know, you've had some highlight knockouts. You fought legends like Crow Cop in your career. You know, you've won titles. So do you think about your legacy at all? How do you want to be remembered as a fighter? Um, yeah, I definitely think about my legacy. And the funny thing is I feel like I'm not even close to what I'm capable of, um, of accomplishing in MMA. I feel like, uh, if I had won my fight against Crow Cop and my last fight against Jake, like I'd be on a whole nother, uh, I'd probably be, have a lot more exposure and probably more well-known, especially if I beat Crow Cop. But, you know, I had those losses and <clears throat> I feel like I'm still better. I'm, I feel like, although I feel like I'm better than both those guys that I lost to, at the end of the day, a loss is still a loss, but I'm still confident in myself. And, uh, man, I feel like I have a lot more to prove. Um, and the reason why this is a big fight is because it's kind of like the start, you know, it's going to be the start of exactly how I'm, I'm going to build my legacy, um, which I, I, I want to do a lot more in MMA.